Alrighty guys, I'm Morthodon, and we are here for My Hero Academia episode 42, which is also season 3 episode 4 if I'm not mistaken. Uh, hopefully I'm not getting those numbers wrong, but uh, last episode was pretty crazy. We had uh, the villains starting to attack in the end, but the rest of the time they were training and working on their quirks a bit, but they didn't get too far because now they're being interrupted by the villains, which is unfortunate, but... Yeah. Um, I'm really looking forward to this episode, and anybody, you all should know why, because you all should be watching these episodes uh, before you watch my reactions. God bless you if you're watching the reactions while you're watching the show for the first time. If you happen to be doing that, let me know. I'm just curious. I, I highly doubt anybody would do that, though. So. so, yeah, we all know what's up with this episode. So, yeah. I'm... I'm super pumped. Super, super pumped. So, I still got my coffee because we were watching the last episode just a few minutes ago. So, if you guys just got here from the previous one, if you saw me drinking coffee, this is the same one. So, yeah guys, um, I say we just hop right into this one and not beat around the bush too much, shall we? So, we are going to start in 5, 4, 3... Two, one, now. I might be, uh, yeah, a little recap about Coda's backstory. Yeah. Um, the video might be a little off from when I clicked. I think I clicked a little bit before I said now. I hope not. Um, the timer should be accurate. I'll try to sync the timer properly. If you guys could hear my click, try to sync it to that. If not, you can try to sync it to my glasses, too. What I do is I wait for a really dark scene, and you can kind of you can see the reflection of my glasses, so you can tell, um... As soon as it goes from dark to light, you'll know. Like, right, some of these parts of the intro go from dark to light, and you can, uh, you can sync that way, so... Sorry about that way if the syncing is a little weird in this one. <laughs> I actually, that's, that's actually how, I, I'm not a big fan of the reflection of my glasses. I don't know how far I'd have to sit away for that to go away, you know? Like, I guess it's not as bad there, but holy crap. Like, I hate, that's the only bad thing about wearing glasses. I would have to sit really far away with like a TV set up and everything for it not to have a reflection but I use it to my advantage because using that, I get, like, near-perfect to the frame syncing when I'm editing my videos, which I've noticed some reactors I watch, um, they don't get the perfect syncing that I feel like I get, but... But that's for my my cut up reactions uh, that you guys see that I upload to Vimeo because I'm actually embedding the f or yeah I'm actually putting the footage into the episode, which is how I sync it. For these full length styles, it's kind of hard because I go off the I go off the click, so sometimes I can't hear the click and it's a little weird. Anyway, let's jump into reaction or not reaction mode, but episode mode. Yep, someone who will rest their lives. Just noticing that now? Mm. Yep. Five minutes earlier. <laughs> uh, I actually think we have some licorice. Uh, that's super tempting, but super bad for my diet that I'm trying to do.
<laughs> God damn it, Monoma. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a creepy dude. <laughs> that guy puts his hand up to his ear. I guess he's trying to block, like, the other sound of them talking. But it's like, it should be in his head, so... Oh shit. That's how we're going in to be a badass. Ooh. Damn. Hmm. Jeez. Yeah, they are the ones his ideology brought. That sword is ridiculous. I wonder if Spinner has a quirk. We never really see it, right? Or is his quirk his body? I guess the quirk is usually their body, so like... I wonder what benefits that gives them. Or if it doesn't really give them any. Having like lizard skin or whatever. Being like a lizard man. Ooh. Tiger's mad. Mm hmm Midoriya knows where he is. Yeah. Gas masks. Momo so good. Yep, the differences between the classes. Ah, oh. Tetsu, 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 Tetsu. Getting serious and badass. Yeah, I got a little bit of chills from his speech. It's so good. What a badass. Mm. Yep, yeah, he's in trouble. Yeah. Mm hmm. Such a shitty coincidence that the guy that murdered his parents is standing right in front of him right now. Yeah.
Yeah. Man, I feel like... I feel like he has to have something to do with Bakugo, right? Like, he looks so much like Bakugo. Either this show is just very bad at designing characters, or there's some kind of connection, right? That's what I feel like, but as far as I've seen, there isn't, so I don't know. Yo. Can't call for help. Yeah. Just gonna do it. <laughs> I love this so much. He doesn't quite nail it, but I think it's close enough. Smiling in the face of danger. To try to bring hope to the ones around him. I guess it's probably thinner, the smoke, where they are, but Bakugo seems to be suffering a little bit through that smoke while covering his mouth still, but Todoroki isn't covering his mouth at all, and jeez, I, I was so unsettled with that severed hand in this episode. I was freaking out when I first saw that shit. Uh I wonder if this guy is like a cannibal. <laughs> it <laughs> oh, I always love that. Jeez, that power is so crazy. Poor friggin' Mandalay getting thrown all around. Is that her name? I think it is. He's pretty strong though, Magna. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. Ugh. Bones crunching. It doesn't like... It's weird. It makes me... It doesn't like sicken me out, but it makes me cringe a little bit, if that makes any sense. Hmm. Oh. Damn. Just gets beat up so quickly, man. But against an adult, like, when you look at their size difference, like, that's so much longer to be able to develop your quirk. And your body. Just nothing. Oh man. So gross how they're like wiggling. <laughs> 
But it looks pretty cool how, like, when they stop wiggling like that, that shot of them right there was actually pretty cool. It reminds me of, like, some kind of armor from, like, a, like, like WoW or something, like, World of Warcraft or something. Oh, God, my knuckle is still bruised. I just barely touched it and it hurt. Coda. Yeah. Um... Sorry, I was looking at my face on my other monitor. I've got like, looks like a red mark on my cheek. I might take a closer look at that. I don't know if that's like a... Like, I know I have, like, a, a pimple there, but right above it, like, right here. I don't know. Sorry. Ugh. Just wanted to kill. Damn, that stings. Midoriya, yes. Mmm, chills. Jeez. A hero's job is to risk his life to make the lip service into reality. Oh god, it's so good. Oh, the shirt tearing. Oh, damn. Luckily, well, Midoriya got there in time. Yep. Yeah. Oh, that arm is so messed up. <laughs> God, he is jacked. Look at those back muscles. Now he's getting serious. Oh shit. Jeez. God. Mm, I love this conflicting part of his mind where... Oh, this is so good. I don't even have any words to, like, describe why it, like, how I like it so much. Oh, it's so good. Oh, the music. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm getting, like, so excited that I'm tearing up a little bit just from, like, the anticipation and the music. Daijobu, indeed. Oh, 
Oh. He looks so badass. Man, all the music just cuts out. God, the voice acting is so good. Damn. Coda. The light coming back to his eyes. This moment right here. <laughs> As if. Yes! Oh, <laughs> I love it so much! Yeah. Cause he's a hero. My hero. Ah! Guys, this is how much I love this show is... I've seen this my first time watching. And then I've seen two or three reactions to this show. And I still get to the point where I need to rub my eyes... Because I got so teary-eyed at that part. Not because it's sad. I don't know if any of you guys ever get this, but when something is so epic, it just gives you chills. My eyes start to water like, holy shit, guys. Oh my god. Ugh. This show, man. I don't know. Like, the thing is, is, I always hate, like, I guess it's a very hipster outlook, and I don't, I'm not even a big fan of, like, the whole hipster thing. I try to only like what I like, but when everybody likes something, <clears throat> and people that, I think the big thing for me is people that make fun of anime, and trash talk anime, but then they really get into this show, but then they still trash talk anime, I think that's what gets to me the most. Um, here, I'm going to talk about this more because we're about to have to skip yeah, preview. So, guys, that's the end of 42. I'm going to finish up my thought real fast here. Um, so, I guess what I was trying to say is I've known people who have bashed anime and said, like, 
you know, animes for children, animes for weirdos, but then they watched, like, uh, Attack on Titan. When when that went through its phase, like, when season one first came out for Attack on Titan, I remember so many people that were not into anime at all watching that and loving it, but they still trash talk anime, and that's just what I'm not a big fan of. And my hero's getting to the point where people who don't watch anime are watching it and loving it and still trash talk anime. And I guess that's just what I don't like. And it almost, like, I I'm trying my best not to let it impact my view of, you know, my hero. Because the two are together in that, but it's not my hero's fault. It's it's because my hero is such a good show, you know? Um, but... God, I love this show so damn much. It is actually insane. Like, watching this episode again made me want to go to another reactor again and rewatch the whole show again. Like, and I'm just doing this rewatch with you guys now. Like, and I've seen other reactions of it, and I've seen the show the initial time. So, like, I swear, I don't know how long I'm going to do it for, but. I'm probably going to be re-watching this show for years, honestly. Like, man, I don't know when I'm going to actually get sick of it, <laughs> but, oh, I just love it so much. Anyway, God. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode as much as me. If you don't, that's fine, too. If you're just like, it was a good episode, you know. Um, I know every, like... It's so hard because when when I like something so much, it's hard for me to imagine other people not liking it, but I know that other people aren't as into it, you know? So I realize people have different opinions and everything, so if you weren't as captivated by this episode as I was, that's fine, you know? Everyone's entitled to their opinions, but I absolutely love this episode, I love this show, I love everything about it, so I hope you guys did too. So, I guess uh, I will see you guys in the next one, which I will not be watching tonight. I'll be starting that up tomorrow, which is good, because I need to wind down after that crap. Holy crap. But yeah, guys, so I'm going to end it here. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel if you did. And check out my other reactions if you're enjoying this content. If you've seen any of those other shows, check them out. Um... And then, yeah, you can check the description for links to my Patreon if you want to support the channel, my anime list if you want to show the, or if you want to see the shows I've watched and the shows I plan to watch, and then also a link to my Twitch stream, which I don't stream too often, but I try to do it here and there. So I, I enjoy the streaming, but sometimes I just don't get to it. That's the only thing. Um, but yeah, guys, once again, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.